Are we actually out of platinum completely? Yes, we are. Um, we only made 549 field emitters here, so that could be an issue. We're gonna need more platinum, which means I'm gonna do a quick ship that can mine platinum that has a shield on it. That way we can go to space real quick. It's gotta be space capable, so we're gonna use hydrogen. Well, yeah, hydrogen first. Uh, let's see, I need landing gear and what's good YouTube welcome back for episode 5 of automating an empire yeah, as you see in this video we're actually going to make a space worthy miner go ahead and get what I need for this I'm trying to figure should I use hydrogen on this I think I should unfortunately I'll need to right now I don't really want to use the thruster components until well actually yeah I can we'll, we'll do that uh, let's see large ship or large uh, I'm gonna need some interior plates. All right, so let's see, drills. Uh, we're gonna put the cockpit up front, so that means I'm going to need small convec or conveyor. There we go, and now we can put the cockpit. I'm gonna put two large atmospheric thrusters. Actually, I'm gonna need four if I wanna fill this thing up with platinum. And as we saw before, we can have up to three in between. Actually, let me do this and add another layer of these. I'm going to do three of these, I guess. Uh, so if you wonder where I came up with this uh, setup for my drills, I actually have a video on the optimal drill placement for small drills. And apparently it turns out that three blocks in between on the sides and two blocks in between on the tops works out really really nicely in fact that should have been one higher so let's do this there we go do the same thing down here that is actually the optimal drill placement for small drills uh and by the time this one comes out i should have already released the one for large drills as well if you're wondering about that <laughs> yeah he didn't stand a chance all right so let's see i need to run all right now i just need my thrusters uh ion thrusters figure out my battery situation here there we go that should be enough batteries and let me think uh we need a gyro we're gonna have shields just to try to get away from anything that might attack us and a connector now there was one thing i was missing what am i missing i know i'm missing something here but first off i don't like where that's placed so let's go ahead and move it i know it's got to be exposed somewhere put it there um what else was i missing probably want to put a gun on here that's not gonna fit it'll fit on the bottom all right what's getting shot at uh, just one of those. Okay, so I'm actually going to need... Well, I can use those thrusters here for getting around. Okay, that'll work. Uh, let's see. All I really need is those downward thrusters. So we should be good on this or not. I don't have the right thrusters here. Let me kill the power. <laughs> Ooh, that was so close right there. I need forward thrusters. Oh, yeah, I need to spit out the rock, don't I? That's what I needed. I knew I was missing something there. Oh, these things are weak. As soon as I can get back over to the base, I'll put on some better thrusters for an atmosphere. Then I need one forward and one backward. All right, so the next thing I want to do here, now that we've actually got this stabilized, is I need sorters and I need ejectors and since we're going to be in space i can actually fire them in pretty much any direction i want to i just got to be kind of careful with the way that i'm digging and i'm not going to fire it directly at pieces of the ship this should be plenty for what we got going here okay so all that's left now is to set this stuff up and go ahead and park this thing to charge my batteries and I might add a gun before I'm at it before I go if I can find a laser turret that'll fit I probably will okay so the laser turrets don't fit on the small ships see does the 
Gatling per fit the way I want it to. Won't fit there. Will it fit down here? Yes. I just hope it doesn't shoot through the drills. All right, so we've got a Gatling turret. Uh, we have drills. We have the batteries. We pretty much have everything. We've got the shields. Let's make sure that the shields are gonna work. No valid controller, so I actually have to put a controller on. Let's see, where can I fit one of them? Right in here. Let's go ahead and set these batteries up. So let's go ahead and get started on this. I added a little bit of a programmable block, uh, basically a script to this to allow it to act like it's in space when you've got the dampeners cut off. Uh, it's one that I showed in my other playthrough. Let me find it real quick. I'll show it to you. Uh, go to the programmable block here. Yeah, there we go. And if we go into edit, it will show you which one it is. Uh, let's see, browse scripts. I went down and did better lack of dampeners here. It is in the mod list, so you'll be able to get it from there. Okay, let me cancel out of all of that. And I need to test. Okay, yeah, we're good. So basically what I want to do is get it up to about 250 meters per second, which is the max here. And I want to cut my dampeners off and just go straight up. So let me go on and line up for straight up. Do that and cut the dampeners off. Once I get the 250 meters straight up, it should continue to go. Oh, it is actually slowing down. Okay. I'm going to keep from fighting against the speed limit here. And as soon as we get to where we're not getting any more thrust from the atmospheric engines, we're going to turn straight away from the planet. Okay, that's about now. Turn away from the planet and go straight up. Hopefully we can get high enough to where we can break out of gravity here. Uh, so far so good. It looks like we might be able to escape. Maybe. We're slowing down a little bit, but we're starting to get out of planetary gravity here, so... Hopefully. Oh, yeah, we're going back up. We are good to go. We made we actually escaped the uh, planet's gravity and we are speeding up again Awesome, so we made it into space Now all we need to do is find an asteroid with platinum on it, which Dummy me there is one thing I did forget. I forgot to put a detector on my ship so I'm gonna have to put a detector on it when I get back. But for now, we'll just ride around, fly around with our drill and try to find one. All right, we're at 0.07 G now. We're coming out of the gravity well. So hopefully we'll hit that before we get past these two asteroids, or these few asteroids here. Now I'm gonna have to fly around from asteroid to asteroid to start with to find some platinum. That's gonna be a thing I have to do. All right, we are out of gravity. So I'm going to turn on my dampeners and slow us down. We're moving quite quickly here. So wherever I stop, I'll end up, uh, let me go ahead and do this since we've got more thrusters in this direction. Wherever we stop, uh, I'll go ahead and put a GPS marker so I know where to get back to my ship. And then I'll fly around from asteroid to asteroid looking for platinum. All right, we are stopped. So now I'm going to make a GPS and hop out. I might want to put my helmet on and I'm gonna run around looking for platinum. At least we've got the elite drill. That way we don't have to worry so much about being able to find anything. It, it'll have a larger radius for finding things. This one looks like it may be barren. I'll check this one over here. Yeah, this is a barren asteroid. Uh, let's see, let's go try this one. Wonder if this dude saw me. No, he didn't. He's moving away. Good. There's ice. I haven't found anything besides ice so far, which is kind of worrisome, actually. Okay, I found some iron, it looks like, here. So at least I know that there is stuff in these asteroids. Yeah, iron. So we'll fly on through the center here and see if we find anything other than iron in this asteroid. So far, just iron. 
Okay, I found some silicon too. Okay, we're getting low on energy now. I gotta head back to the ship. Let me GPS this. So I know where I'm at. Cut off my light here. I'll bring the ship in closer to this asteroid. We got us a hacker drone pretty close by too, so we gotta be careful with that. Luckily, I didn't add an antenna to this. Okay, I'm gonna hide in this asteroid right here, just in case something comes up. I'm gonna turn around and be ready to run if I need to. We're almost out of oxygen too, so that's something I gotta pay attention to. Let me go mark my asteroid here. Ah, uh, we got a corrupt drone here. And it looks like he's after me. I'm gonna have to get in the ship because it's got the best defenses. Got him. He's gonna come in to try to explode on me if uh, I don't take him out. Okay, he's out of commission. I'm just gonna leave my ship here. And go look for what I need. Found uranium. And I'm almost out of oxygen, so I'm gonna mark this and I'm going to head back to the planet, pick up my detector and bring an extra bottle of oxygen just in case. All right, we're back at the base and landed. Now, oh, I forgot to turn those off, didn't I? All right, so now, what do I need to do? Uh, I need to make sure that there is nothing. Oh wait, no, okay, so I need detector. Okay, there is a detector. Uh, I think that's all I'm gonna need, actually, is an ore detector. Okay, now that we've got that working, let's go ahead and head back into space. There we go, found some platinum. Let me mark this on the GPS. There's the platinum. I need to pick up some uranium while I'm out here too. I'll, I'll finish off this platinum if I can and then I'll go after the uranium. I just noticed I'm out of uranium in my reactors here. Alright, I'm heading over for some uranium and then we'll head back to the base. Okay, I've got quite a bit of uranium here. I got about 76,000 uranium. That should be good. So I'm going to head on back to the base. That'll be good until we can get something better going. And I got a little bit of platinum too. We're gonna upgrade this miner anyway. We're gonna get more thrust. It's gonna definitely need it. All right, I'm back at base and we are loading up all of the uranium and all of the platinum. All right, we are making more platinum. Yeah, we were running pretty low on uranium. It's a good thing that we did this. All right, so while I am here, I need to add more thrusters. Okay, so we got plenty of thrust now. That should be worthy of uh, what we need to do. And I think this is a good stopping point, so I'm gonna leave the video here. Thank you for watching the video all the way through. If you haven't already, please drop a like and let me know that you did. In the next video, we're gonna work on a large scale ship. If you haven't already, please think about subscribing and help us reach our goal of 1,000 subscribers. If you like what you saw and you wanna see more, Pick one of the two videos on your screen now. Thank you. Have a nice day.